What's up and welcome back to the Metal Hub Car Show. That's right, Mazda is bringing back the rotary. <laughs> go over the most recent history of the fire spitting Dorito chamber. <laughs> the last production car that used a rotary engine was the Mazda RX-8. The Mazda RX-8 ran from about 2002 to 2012 with the gorgeous R3 design at the end. Mazda poked at the idea of a rotary car in 2015 with the Mazda RX Vision, but that never came to be. It was just a beautiful production car that we never got. But now we're finally getting a new one with the Mazda MX-30. <laughs> yes, that's right. The all-electric car that Mazda made is now being switched to a hybrid with a rotary engine. The MX-30 was already not loved, not a very good electric car. Why make it a hybrid with one of like the least efficient engines ever? And yes, I know, they're technically very efficient with the quantity of power they make for how small the engine is, but they are absolutely horrible on gas. They were start to finish, and they were hideously unreliable if you didn't know how to drive it properly. I acknowledge the rotary is a very cool engine. I love the RX-7, I love the Mazda Cosmos, and I got a soft spot for the Mazda RX-8. But the idea of bringing it back now and putting it into a crossover hybrid is bafflingly weird to me. And it sort of feels like Mazda saying, you want an RX-9? Well, get Ben, you're getting this crossover. You'll get all the bad fuel economy and poor reliability, but without the benefit of likely not making the same power and looking worse. Not to completely shit on this idea, but it just doesn't make sense to me at all. I can't wrap my mind around why Mazda would possibly think this is a good idea. And what's even a bigger bummer with this is with most countries going with EV mandatory vehicles coming up very soon, it's like this was like kind of the last chance we had to get a Mazda RX-9, and no, we're getting this. And now it's likely never, ever gonna happen. Although, not that I thought a rotary was ever gonna come back. But I wanna know, what's your thoughts on it? Does this make sense, and I'm missing something blatantly obvious? Or is this the most insane shit you've ever heard in your entire life? Let me know in the comments. Thank you all so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you've enjoyed what you've seen. I post on Instagram and occasionally TikTok, and I'll see you later.